For division of decimals, we rely once again on our base 10 blocks, flats, rods, and cubes. And in this particular problem, you can see that we have a number of 1 and 2 rods and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, or 1 and 27 hundredths. And we'd like to divide our number into three equal groups. So in order to do this, we must split our flat or our whole and trade it in for a flat that is made out of 10 rods because 10 times 10 is 100. We break up our rods or our flat into rods, excuse me, and then at least we have somewhere to begin. So we start distributing into three groups. So far there's enough for each group to have three. There's enough for four. Now we have cubes left over and we have seven cubes with three groups. So each group can have two, two, four, six, with one cube left over. If we split this cube into thirds, we can evenly distribute so that each group could have three rods, excuse me, four rods and two and one third cubes. 